Hello, my name is Yasin Rezgi, and I'm a developer relations engineer on Android. Today, I'll tell you everything to know to migrate your app to be compatible with 16 KB memory page sizes. But first, let me explain to you what's a memory page and how a program access memory. When your app reads or writes variables, it stores them in a volatile memory known commonly as physical memory or RAM. To simplify its organization and reduce waste space, data is stored in a fixed size block, and we call this block a memory page. And on Android, historically, they are 4 KB each. And when an app needs more memory, more memory pages will be allocated. Each memory will have its own physical address to locate it inside the physical memory. But your app doesn't directly access the physical memory. Instead, it will interact with an abstraction layer we call virtual memory. It keeps processes memories isolated from each other. The system will translate virtual memory addresses to the physical memory addresses. OK, now we know how memory is organized in pages, and they come in a fixed size to better organize it. Your app doesn't access the RAM directly, but through the virtual memory instead. The system does a lookup between them, and it can access recent entries faster as their lookup have been cached. What happens when the page size changes to 16 KB? Now, let's take a simplified example of your app accessing, for example, a 15 KB buffer stored in memory. On a 4 KB page size device, your app has to fetch four pages to get the entire buffer. Each of these four reads will have to go through the system doing the lookup between the virtual and physical memory. With a 16 KB page size, the same buffer fetching will require only one single memory page. In short, a bigger page size boosts memory access speed by reducing the system overhead associated with frequent address lookups. This comes with a higher memory cost as the system reserves a full 16 KB page even if your app needs less data. In our test, we've seen a reduction of 4.6% in power usage when 16 KB page size is enabled, and up to 30% faster app launch time. So now that you know about this change, let me tell you how to migrate your app to be compatible with 16 KB page size. Upgrade to AGP, 8.5.1, or a more recent version, and we recommend uncompressed native libraries. But compressed libraries will still work on 16 KB mode. If you have any native code included in your app, rebuild it with NDK version R28 or above, and don't assume the page size in your code base. Lastly, make sure your app's dependencies are also compatible, and if not, contact their developers for an updated version. If your app is purely written in Java or Kotlin, you're already good to go. The Android runtime has been updated to handle the new page size for you. In the case you have native dependencies, you'll have to upgrade to compatible versions. And for native apps, the code base will have to be updated to remove any assumption of a page size. Regardless of its tech stack, we recommend you to test your app using the 16 KB emulator image or the developer option on Pixel 8 series and higher. Make sure to test both 4KB and 16KB runtimes to avoid any regressions. Download the latest version of Android Studio to check your app's compatibility, including for each native dependency in the APK analyzer. Android Studio provides warnings if your pre-built libraries or APKs are not 16KB compliant. Additionally, Lint in Android Studio now highlights the native libraries which are not 16KB aligned in your project's dependencies. For your releases, the App Bundle Explorer in the Google Play Developer Console also indicates which release is compatible with 16KB page size. Starting November 1st, 2025, apps targeting Android 15 and above will have to be compatible with 16KB page size. Your app's updates will be paused until it's compatible with the new page size. Your app won't be installable on 16 KB page sizes devices coming up in the future. If you're interested to learn more 
about the technical details behind the 16 KB page size implementation, I recommend watching the video made by my colleague Steven, the engineering lead of Android 16 KB team. Thank you for watching and happy migration.